Phil-centric Phil Thomas Cat here. My good friend Tommy Robinetti right over there. You know, I don't know how much longer it's going to be, but one day, you can't use eccentric. They just say you're crazy. Oh, really? Yeah. Like things change and how words start meaning different things? No, it's just that, you know, sometimes you, it's amazing how you go from eccentric to just that crazy old guy, you know. Let me know before I get there. I'm just, I'm just telling you there may be a time limit on eccentric, I'm just saying. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Okay. Anyway, I made it over to the Five Sisters Blues Cafe the other, other morning. For lunch? I uh, know, actually, for their breakfast brunch. Oh, Sunday ooh. breakfast brunch. It was great. What'd you have? I don't know exactly what it was called, but it was... Um, Bless it, your heart. It was, it was good. It was on the menu. I enough. picked it out. You just point at it. Had some poached eggs Maybe on it. some of that. And some steak. Ooh. Sounds like Egg St. Louis. I don't remember which city it was, but it was very good. It's, it's, I think it's Southern cooking. Okay. We know St. Louis in there. All right. Did it have hollandaise sauce on it? Yes, it did. It was Egg St. Louis. Anyway, go ahead. Okay. Sounds good. While there, Clarence Bell was there performing the, the music that morning. Man, this guy is great. From yeah. what I understand, yeah, from what I understand, he actually uh, played with Stevie Wonder before. Did he, really? Yeah. And he's, you know, no offense to Stevie, I love Stevie, but this Clarence Bell guy is as good as Stevie Wonder. He is well, good. Well, let's have a listen. <laughs> Sisters, 
Discover who's coming soon to the show on the Easy Schedule page at theunchartedzone.com.